<laughs> Why is it every time we start video and the wind gets up? It does it all the time. Oh, um, we've been here for we've been here for quite a few hours. It's yeah. Shall we say where we are? Bit. Yeah. Where are we? Wass Water. Yeah. We're in the Lake District. A little bit um, further afield than we normally go. We travelled up in the motorhome. Yep. And um, we're here for several days. We are. This is our first stop. Yep. And um, we are going, um, stopped off at Westwater on the way to Scapel. Yep. We had lovely calm conditions, although um, you wouldn't think it at the moment. Um, but we did have lovely calm conditions when we got here. There was no wind. The lake was all lovely and still, wasn't it, Jim? We had a little bit of light left over from the sunrise, which wasn't brilliant this morning because there was a lot of cloud cover, but we still had some light, didn't we? We had a tawny owl on the way. We had a tawny owl on the that way, which we beautiful. couldn't film because we were driving in yeah. single lane tracks and all that. It's quite difficult. Um, but we're loving it, aren't we? Yes. This is the composition we got when we first got here with the stones... Um, at the front of the scene to give a little bit of foreground interest. Gem got the same, but as you can see, it's really choppy now, the water, but when we got here, it was as often is the case first thing in the morning, the, the water was really calm, so we were lucky there. to the motorhome, maybe get some quick brekkie in there and then um, where are we, are we driving somewhere else? We're going to Scaffale which is just there. Oh we're going to the other car park, yeah we're going to drive to a different car park further up the lake and uh, hit Scaffale Pike, so we'll see you shortly. I got this from the barn door shop which is next to the <coughs> Westwater Inn where we have parked and um, you'd have seen us talking earlier for, from about here. Okay, it's quarter to six. We've finally made it here. Um, and pretty non-eventful journey. Um, <laughs> it's there's no cloud, so it's just going to be. I can still see the moon, and it's just going to be bam, too bright. But we're now going to walk that way about 10-15 minutes to hopefully find the lone tree of Buttermere if they're still here. 
and not been washed away by storms since the last time I came about four years ago um, so we're off now 10-15 minute walk try and find the lone tree it's cold we're in need of a, a hearty brunch I think somewhere Gemma wouldn't you agree we've got quite a few hours before you get one of them yeah so we'll see you down at the tree Is that your famous trip? Starting to see the views as we head to on the Lakeshore Trail towards the shore of Buttermere. We're here. The lone tree is. Uh, I haven't seen it yet, but it's down there somewhere. I've got to work out how to open this gate. My engineer. We found the tree, um, and it's just a case of wandering around to try and frame the tree with the hills and mountains in the background without hiding the peaks with the tree so I'll place the tree at the base of that one I'm not overly pleased but I might change the vertical height of it slightly so I don't chop the top off the tree um, there's a bit of cloud blowing over now and hopefully the tide is coming in so as the tide comes in um, I've been before when the water has been right around the tree which is ideal so hopefully I think it does look like the tide is coming in yeah we might be lucky in another 20 minutes or so and have a bit more of the base of the tree covered with water but there's cloud blowing in from the left here with a bit of morning pinkness um, it's just a case of keep shooting and seeing if the conditions change there's way too much wind really there's ripples on the water as you can see that's what I was going to say I'm going to do one exposure fast to capture the leaves of the tree yes. and then a slow exposure yep. for the um, water yeah I don't know whether I'm going to put a filter on to try and blur the water I really wanted reflections but it's, it is what it is so we'll just carry on shooting and see what we get well, we're sort of calling it. We're now getting the light rising above the surrounding hills and mountains, which is painting some light on the peaks there and there, as you can probably see just about. But as Jem said, it's just harsh. It's just... But anyway, we, we, anyway, we got here. lone tree this is our washed out sky Hassie's back safe and sound yep um, we haven't got the mics on but it's, it's wind, yeah. wind shouldn't be too bad should no, it no. so we're off to we're done here yep Hold hope on. you've got something out of this vlog in less than perfect conditions. Hold on. Yeah, we hope you've got something out of this vlog in less than perfect conditions, but we still enjoyed ourselves. We still got down here and made the effort, Gemma. Yep. And we've so got we took, some images. 
an exposure for the water, mm -hmm. longer exposure to smooth out the water. Yep. But it is quite windy. Mm. That's why we've got ripples on the water. So then I've taken a, a much faster shutter speed to um, get the, all the little branches and the leaves crisp. Yep. And so we'll layer them together and also different exposure for the washed out sky to try and capture the very little clouds we had. A couple of pink. Yeah, we did. And uh, one bonus we've failed to mention, which is a biggie. We're the only ones here. Yes, yes. Which is get lovely. Get up early, get the place to yourself. Only when we, um, in part one, when we went to Wast Water, when we eventually left, it was heaving. It was, there yes. Was so many people. Well, there. I think Parked it's... cars, everything. Every, obviously, everybody's wanted to... Um, Go somewhere. It's the same as holidays. Cornwall. As Cornwall has been heaving as so, sad, isn't it? So late district to say. Up early, get the shot, leave. <laughs> yeah. Well, but up early for normally the best conditions for photography is just that the um, landscape gods haven't shone on us, have they? Yeah. No. But no. there we go. It's been a nice break, isn't it? Yep. And um, we we might have one place tomorrow. Yeah, we, yeah we're driving home tomorrow, but we don't know if we might stop on the way. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how things go. Well, weather-wise as well. Yeah. So this is Rich and Jim. Yeah. Saying goodbye. Bye. Bye. Bye.